Oh, yeah. I mean, that's a lemon blueberry muffin right there. Today, I'm showing you how to make the ultimate lemon blueberry muffin with a gorgeous cream cheese filling. These are a twist on the classic blueberry muffin, leveled up with a sweet surprise from the filling and bursting with fresh lemon flavor. All you really need to make this are some pantry staples, cream cheese, lemon, and blueberries. Welcome back. My name is Daniel, a home cook who's passionate about food, here to show you simplified recipes that are easy to follow using common ingredients. If you're new to this channel, be sure to hit subscribe and the notification bell for more recipes that your friends and family will love. Now let's get started on those lemon blueberry muffins. Start with grating the zest of one whole lemon. Be sure to only use the yellow and not the white part, which is bitter. This should yield about one tablespoon of lemon zest. Also, squeeze about one and a half teaspoons of lemon juice and set that aside. To make the filling, place two ounces of cream cheese into a bowl. Add one and a half tablespoons of white sugar, a splash of vanilla extract, one tablespoon of milk, and just a sprinkle of lemon zest. Break up the cream cheese and mix this all together. It will be lumpy at first, but gets smoother as you continue to stir. Don't worry if there are any tiny lumps remaining, they will melt while baking. Next, measure out one cup of blueberries. I'm using unthawed frozen here. Feel free to use fresh blueberries. Coat it in one tablespoon of flour that will prevent it from sinking later. For the dry ingredients, sift one and a half cups of all-purpose flour, half a teaspoon of salt, and two teaspoons of baking powder. Whisk this all together until well combined and set it aside. Add a quarter cup of softened butter, the rest of the lemon zest, and a half cup of white sugar. Cream this all together until it turns pale, light, and fluffy. Today I'll be doing this by hand, but you can absolutely use an electric mixer if you prefer. It's ready when it looks something like this. Crack in one whole egg, a half teaspoon of vanilla extract, and the one and a half teaspoons of lemon juice we squeezed earlier. Stir this all together to combine well. Switching to a whisk to make things easier. It is normal for it to start curdling. Don't worry, that is just the acid from the lemon juice reacting with the dairy. It's ready when it looks like this. Next, measure out half a cup of milk. We will use it soon. Pour half of the flour mixture into the batter and stir it in a little. Then add half of the milk and gently combine this all together. You do not want to overmix the batter at this stage or gluten will develop and you will get a tough muffin. When the flour has disappeared into the batter, repeat the same steps with the remaining flour and milk. Remember to stir this only until it is just combined. Note that this is quite a thick batter, but trust me, the muffins will come out super soft and fluffy. Once it looks like that, add in the blueberries and fold them in gently. Because I'm using frozen blueberries here, the color will make the batter turn a little purple, but don't worry, it will still be absolutely delicious. Now preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit and scoop some batter into a well-greased muffin paper cup. Then, put as much cream cheese filling as you wish in the center and top with some more batter. Repeat this for all the muffins. I didn't have enough muffin cups of the same size, so I made six medium large muffins and six small muffins. If you don't have paper cups, you can bake them directly in the muffin tin, but make sure to grease them well so you can remove them easily. They're now ready for the oven. Bake them at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 minutes. That is for the medium-large muffins. If you are making small muffins, pull them out two to three minutes earlier. Remove them from the oven when they are finished baking. And check for doneness with the toothpick. If it comes out clean, they are done. Let them cool before digging in. And there you have it. Super delicious lemon blueberry muffins with a cream cheese filling that is sure to impress your friends and family. They are perfect as a snack or a dessert. Hope you enjoy. All right, it's time for the taste test. So I'm gonna take the one that I cut open earlier. 
take the first bite. Let's see. Mmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Lemon, 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 lemon flavor with all those blueberries inside. So, so good. Mmm. The second bite. can taste a little bit of that cream cheese. I know it's actually difficult to see the cream cheese in there. Oh! Dropped a piece. So you might not be able to really see the cream cheese, but you can definitely taste it. And it just adds this kind of tangy sweetness to it. That's so delicious. Um, I'm just gonna finish this one. I was only half the muffin, remember? gonna be a special little treat for all your friends and family because they're all gonna be wondering what exactly did you put in this right and it's that cream cheese filling in there now if you want to actually see the cream cheese like oozing out just use like double the amount that I did and maybe don't add the milk into the cream cheese filling so it's more solid and that way when it melts it, it doesn't just kind of seep right into the rest of the muffin. But I just wanted a hint of cream cheese in this one. I didn't want to go overboard. It was my first time trying it with this filling. But it's so good. It adds something really nice to these muffins. They're already really good. The lemon and the blueberries, wonderful combination of flavors. And it's so beautiful and pretty. I mean, look at those. It's not really blue, it turns violet, but or purple. It looks stunning and gorgeous. I'm gonna take one more bite. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's a lemon blueberry muffin right there. So delicious. Be sure to try it. And as always, if you like this video, remember to give me a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments below what are your favorite muffin flavors. Remember to hit subscribe and the notification bell for more videos. I'll see everyone soon. Till next time. Bye everyone.